Okay, I think that works now. Um, I don't know how I'm going to get rid of that stupid little reset thing, but here's Deja Vu. Deja Vu. Um, there's the, the guy with the gun, the, the smug guy with the gun. I'm going to be playing this myself just because i got nothing better to do. And uh, Joe's been busy, so we haven't been getting too much work done on switching over to Twitch streaming. Uh, we know that we're going to need some better Wi-Fi at home, otherwise we're going to have to find some other place to record that has strong Wi-Fi or something. I don't know. Um, I think we can stream at Joe's place, but it won't be that good. We definitely can't stream 720p. You are waking from a stupor that feels like a chronic headache after a week in Vegas. You notice your right palm is covered with dry blood. Now this is important. We noticed this in uh, in the first playthrough we did that um, you can neither see nor feel any wounds. Well, how about this next statement? You feel a sharp pain on your left forearm. Okay, I feel a wound. Rolling up the sleeve, you find a tiny puncture on your arm. I now see a wound. It, both statements totally contradicted immediately after they're made. Has a doctor injected me with a medicine? Yes, this is my voice? Oh my goodness. I didn't know that would be my voice. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> You have no idea where you are and why you're here. You have no memory whatsoever. That's too bad. All right, so unlike the game playthrough on Let's Play Everything, I'm gonna be doing everything. Um, examine, let's examine everything. What's this little thing here? It's the door that leads out of the washroom and possibly into trouble. Into trouble. I don't think it leads out of the washroom. From what I remember, it leads out of the stall. It looks like a beautiful hanging ceiling light. It doesn't look too hanging. It looks like it's... I guess maybe I can't see the cord up above, huh? Looks like it's fixed in the ceiling. It's a full roll of toilet paper. It adds a civilized touch to these barbaric surroundings. <laughs> oh, such a barbaric toilet. And what about, is any of this like graffiti I can read? Doesn't seem to be anything unusual. Is what about, what about this spot here? No, okay. I don't think any of that's graffiti. What about these weird things up on the ceiling? Huh? That's different than other stuff. No. Um, okay, let's see. Who can I speak to? Can I speak to the coat? Who are you speaking to? The coat? Didn't you see me click on the coat? Hit. Let's hit the coat. Wham! Your hand is numb from the impact. Mm, tough coat. There must be something hard under there. <laughs> Close. The door already is closed. Um, open. Let's open the door. And the coat is gone. The door is open. Yes, but... Where did the coat go? Door is open. Door is open. Yeah, I'm trying to examine these things out there. The door is open. Um, take, can I take the coat that was once right here? Where's the coat? You can't take it. I can't take it, man. I just can't take it. Okay. Is the coat, will the coat come back? Psh, 
Coat comes back. What do you know? Okay, so that's stupid. I mean, it wouldn't have been too hard to have a, another animation for the coat hanging at the open angle. Or they could have just had the door open all the way that you didn't see the hook. Right? I mean, they didn't have to show the door. It can open so wide. <coughs> oh, no, something just... Something just popped up on my thing. Did it? No, it wouldn't have been visible on my, there anyhow. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of recording this live just to give it the... Uh, streaming feel that we might be ending up with um, but I'm not streaming live so I think everything's still going I just glanced over my screen and I thought I saw a warning of some kind it went away and I think everything's running fine okay so let us Examine the coat. I didn't do that before. It's a light brown trench coat that matches your trousers. Hmm. Can I take off my trousers? You feel something in the pocket of the coat. Right, I think you got to open. Open the coat. Open the pocket. Um, okay, so... Can I open the sunglasses? No. Um, oh, can I use? Use sunglasses. Oh no, they say you have to take it, right? Can't use what you haven't taken, right? I remember that from before. Okay. Take the sunglasses. <coughs> the sunglass. Oh, it's just a sunglass. Shit. I thought it was sunglasses. It's a sunglass. Whatever it is. Um, let's take the hanky. Maybe we should just take it all, right? Take the gum. How do you put stuff back into a thing? Let's see. I think it would probably be this leave option, right? Let me try to put the gum back in the coat. Leave gum. You ask yourself, where can I leave it? Um, oh, in the coat. Click on the coat. Maybe you can't leave it here. No, okay, in the pocket. Oh, yeah, of course. I'll just put it on an empty slot in the coat, right? Oh, I have to re-leave, right? Leave gone. Where can I leave it? Okay, now I'm on the gum and I'm leaving it in the coat. No! Coat? No, I can't. What? Can I leave it in the wallet? Maybe you can't leave it here. Well, fuck. Okay, I don't know how to put items back into a thing. That doesn't seem to be something I'm capable of. Let's keep taking things. Take everything I can take. Coin, lighter, wallet. <clears throat> Take coin. Mm hmm. Now, the wallet you can open and look in the wallet. What's in the wallet? Hmm, a key, a card. Let's open the card. Can't do that. Okay. Not a Walmart or a Hallmark Hallmark card, right? It's not a greeting card. I can't open it. Let us take. Let us take the twenty dollar bill. Mm-hmm. Let us take the card. We'll examine all these things in a minute. We'll just get them all into my inventory first. Take the key. We will take go oh, I don't think we can take the lock here. We gotta go. Oh, right, I think we have to close the wallet. Let's close the wallet. Okay. And now we will take the wallet. OK. 
Okay. Now we can close the pocket. Yes, okay. And so now I don't have any open inventories. I just have goods. Okay. Address. I have addresses? Oh, I wonder if there's fast travel in the game. <coughs> um, okay, okay, we can take the code now. Oh, wham, that's what I hit my hand on. Mm-hmm. Um, examine it. Don't touch it. The 38 special. What's so special about it? It's a Dirty Harry reference. Am I Dirty Harry in this game? Um, open it. Is there a bullet in it? Okay, I can, yeah. Bully... Bull one equal three. Huh? Okay, so let's take the bull one equal three. Can't do that here. Where can I do it then? I can't I take take the bullets out. In fact, I kinda Hold on, let me see if I can wear things. Because I don't know if I can wear that gun. It has a holster. Um, good. So, sunglass. Let's examine the sunglass and see if it's actually sunglasses. It looks like a pair of sunglasses. The lenses are very dark. Oh. Okay, so I probably... Will it make the screen go black if I put them on? Use sunglass. What would you like to use this on? Um, my face self. Self, of course. Oh, I haven't thought of the self action. What else? Can I, you can't put them on. They're too big. <laughs> they're, they're oversized novelty sunglasses. <laughs> it just has to put them giant. Those ones, you could still put them on a regular face, though. They were... You know, they, they were meant to still fit on her human head. Huh, that's weird. Sunglasses that are too big. I, I must have a small head. I have, I have a tiny little head. Um, <clears throat> okay, but I could have. That was... Okay, what about the coat? Oh, shit, where's the coat? Uh, um, okay, use the coat. Can't do that here. Can't use. Oh, hey, let's use let's use the toilet paper. We should wipe up, huh? You can't do. <laughs> Wait a second. If I can't use the toilet paper in the toilet stall, where can I use it? Here, let's take the toilet paper. We gotta use it somewhere else. You can't take it. I can too. I mean, even if it's locked on, you can just like you know wrap it up. Just take it all. So unravel it until you got it all. <laughs> I can't use it here. I have to take it somewhere. Um, I'm going to hit this fucking toilet paper. Wham! My hand is numb from punching toilet paper. Oh. That's too bad. Oh, now I got this furnace sound going on. I bet that's coming through on the microphone. This might not be the best place for recording. Um, I don't know how long that's going to be going, so, should I pause? No, I don't think I have a pause, I can't, I can either start or stop things, I can't pause things. Let's carry on. Wham, my hand is numb from the impact. Mr. Whipple did not test this toilet paper before they used it. Okay, so, here's the thing. I want to use this holster on myself, right? Can't use what you haven't taken. All right, okay. So I take it, it's in the holster. I want to use it on me, right? So that I'm wearing it. 
like a coat or sunglasses, but I have a feeling I maybe it won't let me kill myself, but I, I have a bad feeling about using, can't use it when it's open. Oh, I left it open. <laughs> Oh, I got whoops. Leave, take, use, close. You know, they could have made that one option just an open slash close because the thing you're using it on is going to be in one state or the other. It's just a toggle effect. Close the gun. Okay, here we go. We are going to equip the gun in the holster. <laughs> On, on myself. That's a great way to go out with a bang. So much for dreams and aspirations. Plam! There's my name. I am Ace Harding. Ah. Till you reach the end. Yep, I just committed suicide. It's in a holster. Where did the holster go? I wanted to put the holster, you know, underneath. Well, I'd put the coat on after maybe getting the holster in. I I don't know. I I don't think we should end here. I'm going to keep going like this will probably be a multi part. <laughs> this will probably be a multi parted series of videos. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Um Hold on, wait, I can like, um, maybe get rid of you hearing and looking at me so I can get my head straight for a second. Because <laughs> I don't think I can do that visually on, on Twitch, right? So, um, just let me figure this out. Um, I want to take off the video. So do we have limited continues? So let's find out. I hate using continues right at the beginning of a game. If they're limited. I mean, because here, look. My starting point is right at the beginning. Only thing I, I passed up was the, the text telling me I woke up in a stupor. Not feeling or seeing wounds, but then suddenly feeling and seeing a wound. I'm covered in blood. Oh, right. Maybe I get that same stuff if I examine myself. You're doing a great job. Keep trying. Okay, examining myself, I find positive reinforcement. What if I speak to myself? Talking to yourself might be fun, but it isn't very helpful. What if I hit myself? Don't pat yourself on the back yet. Um, can I close myself? You can't do that here. I can do it elsewhere. Where can I close myself? <laughs> I want to open myself. What do you think you're doing? Take myself. Can't take it. Leave myself. What do you think you're doing? I'm astral projecting? <laughs> um, use myself. Okay, well, how do I go to the bathroom off? I'm in a toilet. I can't aim at the toilet because it's not in my visual line of sight. I can't use the toilet paper, right? I can't use it here and I can't take it elsewhere. Alright, well, let's uh, let's open the pocket. Let's just grab all the shit. <coughs> open the pocket and open the wallet. Okay, let's, uh, here, I didn't examine stuff before. Let's examine everything now. What happened? Oh, my, my B button took off the action I was working on. What good is that? What if there's no action? What am I doing? It looks like I get examined anyhow. Not, not here, though. But if I'm not on examine here, and I click on it, it comes up as examined. Can I not examine things here? No, I can. Okay. It's a $20 bill. 
It's a card with several holes punched into it. It says private access card, penthouse seagull. Seagull? 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 Seagull. Right, why is that? Hold on. It's I before E except after C unless pronounced as A. So it's not pronounced as A because it's the proper I before E way. Which would be a big I sound? Yeah, Seigel. Seigel. Right? Yeah. When two vowels are next to each other, the first one's long, the second one's small. You know what? I never, <laughs> never turned the video back on. I just realized that because I accidentally flicked off the camera. But then I said, hey, there was no camera. <laughs> But for those of you who wanted to see it, I'll, I'll recreate it. Um, I was saying, when one vowel is next to another vowel, the first one is long, and the second one is short. <laughs> it was funnier to me when I realized I was doing it. Okay. Um... That's all good. Okay, cycle. Uh, key one. It's a key with the word office inscribed on it. I never, I have an engraving tool. I should inscribe words on my keys. I never thought to do that. I just, you know, went the easy route and got those plastic color things you put around them. It seemed, seemed easier. <laughs> Uh, okay, so... Oh, we're still examining. Let's see. Examine all this stuff now. It's a very fine leather wallet. It looks very expensive. Why doesn't it have an ID in it? It looks like a pair of... Yeah, it doesn't say they're giant oversized novelty sunglasses, though. It's a handkerchief with the initials JS. Ooh. That's not Ace Harding. Okay, I know I'm kind of metagaming, I guess. Because <clears throat> I've seen my tombstone <laughs> in, a, in a vision of my future death. <coughs> so, J definitely could stand for Joe. Um, just thinking back to the last game, the Joe's whatever bar it is. Um, okay, so it's not my handkerchief, but technically my character doesn't know that yet. I only know that if I'm dead. Um, gum. It's a piece, only a piece, it's not even a pack. Sugarless, of course. Oh, trident, right? Isn't that the sugarless gum? Lighter. It's a gold-plated lighter. It has the initials JS on it. Boy, this JS guy loved monogram monogramming, right? No, that's when they have like the big circle version. He liked initializing things. Oh, what kind of coins do I have? <clears throat> it's a quarter. <clears throat> okay, seven quarters. That's um, one quarter short of two dollars, so one seventy-five. I got twenty dollars and one seventy-five. Hmm. Address. So I, I examined everything. So now I will take it all. Take this and this. Oh, lots of button pushing to take stuff. Mm -hmm. Back here. But I can't take it if it's open, right? No, I can. Didn't they tell me I can't take the gun? Oh, I can't use the gun when it's open. Okay. So let's keep taking stuff. Let me pick a number. It doesn't say like how many coins. 
Okay, let's now close the coat. And close the wallet. Ah, there it is. It's not alphabetical. Um, yeah, it's in the order I picked it all up. Okay, let's take the coat. I wonder how many pages of goods I can have. I hope it's infinite. Alright, let's take the gun. Did I examine the gun before? Oh yeah, it just says dirty hairy shit. Um, so now we can open the door and it won't be a lie. The hook is empty as it should be. And we can... Let's see, any fun stuff? Let's save. Let's try a save. They said there might be trouble outside of here, after all. Was that it? That was... Save? Yes? No. So simple. Doesn't have me pick a file. It doesn't say, are you sure you want to do it? <clears throat> I mean, I suppose, technically, that window was the are you sure you want to do it window. Um, and that's all there was. Okay, let's move, that's right, we will move this way. You're in the washroom. From the looks of it, you figure the janitors must be on strike. <laughs> oh, should I be reading this in a transatlantic accent to be giving the, uh, the whole noir feel <clears throat> examine things let's examine this Ooh, you see yourself in the mirror you again realize with horror that you can't remember who you are that wasn't a transatlantic accent that was <laughs> that was just my mysterious accent because of that it is a hanging light oh you can see it better this way <coughs> Didn't it say it was fancy before or something? An electric light is hanging from the ceiling. Now I'm... Now I'm curious. Thought it said something different about the... The light when I was in here. It looks like a beautiful hanging ceiling light. It looks like a beautiful hanging ceiling light here. But when I actually step out of the stall, I realize it's not so beautiful. It's just an electric hanging ceiling light. <laughs> an electric light is hanging from the ceiling. Um, how would I turn off a light? I probably have to find a switch, and they don't offer one, so I probably can't do it, huh? Can I close the light? Nope, not here. <laughs> Maybe somewhere else. <laughs> that just that gets me every time. You can't do that here. The door is closed. <clears throat> no, I was just talking about this window. Um, close the faucet. Can't do that here. Yeah, I'm right. I can't open the faucet. Yeah, and I can't open this isn't a medicine cabinet. Um, <clears throat> let's use the faucet. <sighs> use the light. Use the mirror. Use the door. Huh. That's interesting. They don't tell me I can't do it, but they don't let anything happen. I can click a, any old patch of wall will work, but the door doesn't. Okay. Um, let's hit the mirror. Wham, your hand is numb. I don't break the mirror. I'm just gonna try to hit things that I think I can break. 
All right. Open the fucking door then. <clears throat> And uh, move then. Okay, move up of here. You're in a dingy hallway. Doesn't it say like something about, yeah, there's water coming from the ladies' room. It's a puddle on the floor. It appears to be coming from the women's washroom. Let's hope it isn't someone with trouble. Trouble? A plugged up toilet? <laughs> um, speak. You should say hello. What do you think you're doing? I'm announcing that I'm a dude who's coming into the ladies room. That's a polite thing to do. <laughs> okay, now let's try. Before I go in. Hello? I'm sorry, I thought you needed help. <laughs> uh, let's examine. Now I can see more of the puddle. What about this puddle, huh? The door is open. Oh, cracks in the plaster. There are cracks in the wall. Okay. It's a wooden door. You wonder what's behind it. Hmm. Um, <clears throat> well, we didn't go into the ladies' room first time through, so let's get in there. You're in the woman's washroom. Mm-hmm. Well, let's examine stuff. They get a trash can. We men didn't get a trash can. It's a large metal waste basket. Sorry, I thought it was a trash can. A refuse bin. It's an old electric light. Oh, this one's old. Usually the ladies have the better fixtures in their room, washrooms. The mirror is just as grimy as the rest of this place. Hmm. It's only a dirty old sink. I never tried taking a mirror before. Let's, damn it. Stay on there. Take the mirror. Can't take it. No, can I take a trash can? Can't take it. Okay, uh, let's, I think this is probably the door stall then, huh? Open the door. Examine, because I can't see from here. Door is open. Yeah, of course. Move. Okay, nobody in there. You're in an empty stall. You see a crack in the toilet and water pouring out of it. Um, let's see if I can close the water valve on the back of the toilet. The lid is closed. No, I need to, I want to turn off the water because that's the only way to stop the leak, really. I have to... Just turn off the fill water and uh, empty the tank. Mm. Has a fresh crack in it. I could like hold the bobber up and like and uh, I want to fix this problem. <laughs> And the toilet paper. Let's roll the toilet paper. Looks like it hasn't been used yet. Yeah, is this toilet paper soft or is it hard enough to numb my hand? Yeah, that's more of that hard ass toilet paper. Okay, examine this puddle. It's a puddle of water that appears to come around the toilet. Okay, well, let's open the toilet. Can I have to open the top? Open the lid. Nope, I can't open the top. You are relieved that you find nothing inside. Hmm. Examine the hole. Toilet has a fresh crack in it. The water leaks from it and ends up in the hallway. Okay. Um... Well, I don't know. I don't think there's any way that they're going to let me fix 
this toilet. I can close the toilet. Oh, I can use, use the toilet. Can't do that here. Jeez. I want to use the toilet and then use the toilet paper. Why not? Why not? I mean, I've never had a game except for like The Sims. I think The Sims was the first game where I finally was able to video play a, a character using a toilet. <laughs> Maybe not. What did, maybe Earthbound probably had some restrooms you could use or something. I can't remember. There might have been some older games though. Okay, let's uh, let's move. Do I have anything? Do I have a cherry bomb I can throw in the toilet? <laughs> Hanky gum. Let's let's leave. Let's leave the gun in the toilet. Or the coat, maybe that'll soak up the water. Where can I leave it? In the toilet. Maybe you can't leave it here. <laughs> maybe, maybe you can't. <laughs> well, maybe I can then. So how do I do it? <laughs> maybe, maybe <clears throat> you are absolutely not letting me do it. That's That sounds pretty definite. Um, can you leave anything anywhere? I, um... Ooh, I don't know. Um, if I open my wallet, can I leave the 20 back in the wallet? Um... Leave... The 20 in the wallet. Maybe you can't leave it here. <laughs> no. Even like the most definite like place where it is for a thing to go. No, you cannot. Okay. So, this does not concern me. It's just a broken toilet. Um, we can leave the ladies room. Mm-hmm. Let's go and open this door then. Open the door. Move. You're in a dark, empty bar. Obviously, the bar is closed, or else you've scared everyone away. Hmm. Joe's bar, see? That's Joe's. Open the front door. The door won't open. It must be locked. Aha! Um, the key says office, that's right. Um, open this door. What is that door? That looks like it should go out onto the street. We never used this door. Oh, it goes to the wine cellar. Maybe we did use it. We, we, we got down here before. Looks like it could use good sweeping. Alright, let's go back. I'm not done with this place. Um... Examine the window. An empty street with no one in sight. Examine the door. It's the front door of the bar. Yeah, and I should be able to get outside. It's kind of a fire safety issue. Like, anybody should be able to exit a building and bypass any locks in the way of exiting the building. <laughs> Um, okay, so we know that Joe's bar is not fire safe. So, this guy must be up to shifty things. If he doesn't 
want people getting out of his building without his key. I don't like this Joe guy. He seems like a mob boss. And he puts his initials on handkerchiefs and gold-plated lighters. And, uh, and he has a weird front door that he can't get out of. That, that seems to mean he tends to bring people here that he doesn't want escaping. Let's examine this. It's a shot glass full of seltzer. All right, let's let's drink some seltzer then. Can't use wait. Okay, yes. Let's take the shot glass. Take the seltzer. Okay. Now use the seltzer on myself. I want to drink it. Quickly down the seltzer. Ugh. The stuff tastes terrible. Why would anyone drink this stuff? It is weird, yeah. The, I don't know, flavored seltzer waters are... It still says I have seltzer. Oh, I should have examined. Hold on. Examine it. Is it half full or something? The glass is empty. What? Then why does it say it's seltzer still? Shouldn't it say it's a shot glass? I would like to use it on myself. Glass is empty. Okay, well, can I leave the glass where I found it? Here. Leave it here. Damn! What is this? What is the point of leaving things? They don't let me leave anything anywhere. Um, okay, so we can go upstairs or into the cellar. Let's go into the cellar first. Boom! It's a damp and dreary wine cellar. Let's do a save, huh? There we go. Now then, examine what do we have here. It's a wine rack. The bottles are very dusty. One of the bottles on the right hand side appears to be quite clean. Take on the right hand side. That one maybe? Can't take it. Mm. Oh fuck. Open. Open a bottle on the right hand side. What do you think you're doing? Examine. What? It said there's a... What? Why would it point out one special bottle if I can't do anything with it? One of the bottles on the right hand side appears to be quite clean. So it was recently placed there. Someone recently put a bottle here. Hmm, use. I can't use what I haven't taken, so that one now. Examine the spider web. It's a spider web, but no spider. It's just a standard light bulb. Oh, what about the light fixture? Yeah, okay. This thing that says 11111110. It's a barrel of wine. Oh, it's a spigot. Mm -hmm. Open the spigot. Yay. Um, <laughs> it's a spigot. No, what? No, it's not. <laughs> I'm not even up there. I'm down here on the wine flow. Um, Oh, what do I have to put this in? What do I have? Oh, no, it's pouring all out. Um, I need, I need something I can fill up. A hanky? <laughs> start, start cleaning it up with a hanky. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, coat, gun one, seltzer. Oh, there we go. Um, I have this cup. Use shot glass on the spigot. 
Can't do that here. Uh. Every time I think of something I can do, it tells me I can't do it. All right, well, let's close it. Maybe we can get some wine later. Actually, no, let's leave it open and see if it actually does run out or if it's just going to be flowing every time I come in. Um, there's nowhere else to go. We shall move. Well, let me hit the spider web and see if it turns my hand numb. <laughs> Damn fucking hard ass. Fucking spider web. I'll shoot you. Oh. oh, let's shoot the wine barrel. Hold on. Let's close the wine barrel and see if I can open it with a gun. <laughs> Okay, um, where's my gun? There's my gun. I like to use this on. Let's see, let's just try shooting it right in the line barrel. I can't do that here. Oh. Hmm, okay. On the tap. Nope. Hmm. Okay, well. Let's, let's leave, I guess. That's no fun. Oh, I wanted to leave it open. Ah, fuck it. <laughs> I don't know. Let's do it. Leave it open. Leave it open. Yeah, yeah. Open this. Open. Open. Now we'll leave. Just let the wine pour out. Why did it have that gigantic barrel? Well, why has this place been closed, right? It's all dusty. Hmm, I wonder if I could look behind the counter. Well, I don't know. We can go explore upstairs. That's kind of the only place left to go. How is this place situated to where I came out through a door, right? Let's see. Move. And this is like a back hallway. Oh, yeah, okay. So that would be this door, the end of the hallway is the men's room, this is the ladies' room, and that's back into the front of the building. It's hard to wrap my head around. So that, okay, so that door over here represents a door that kind of goes inward to the stairs, underneath the stairs because it's a cellar. Hmm. Well, oh, still flowing. So, yeah, I think we'll just stop here in the bar and we will call that it for part one of the adventure of Deja Vu. And, um, not self. Move myself. Move. Um, that'll be good. So, yeah, we'll continue this another time. Um, see y'all later, or something. I don't know. How do I stop this? Um, here we are. Bye-bye.